Football fans here at Jack Trice Stadium are used to hearing lots of noise during a football game. Well, now music fans will get their turn after nearly a quarter of a century. You won't be. Country music icon George Strait is coming back to Ames. He was the last performer to sing at a big concert in Jack Trice Stadium. That was back in 1999. During the 1990s, fans were treated to huge concerts from performers like Paul McCartney, Billy Joel, and Elton John. Since then, no one has filled the beloved football venue with music. Fans at Iowa State are ready. I think it's really exciting for me. I'm a big country fan, so it's kind of exciting that you know George Strait, really big name there. But uh, I think it's really good for the city. I think it's really good for the, uh, the university. Chris Stapleton will join Strait on the 2024 Nationwide Stadium Tour. I think it'll be awesome. Chris Jorgensen is ISU's Senior Associate Athletics Director. He says the university wants to have more spring concerts in the future. It's a good way to help out the new $200 million Sci-Town project under construction near the stadium. With Jack Trice, with Hilton Coliseum, with C.Y. Stevens, and a, an amphitheater that we plan to build with inside town. We think the uh, music and cultural scene will be a big part of what goes in there. So why has it taken 24 years to bring concerts back? There are two reasons. One, the stadium is only available for concerts in the spring. And two, promoters often balk at paying extra to protect the grass field from damage. That's also one of the reasons why we, we look at an early spring window that if there is any damage, we have enough time to uh, get it get the field ready for football season, which is obviously our, our main priority for in here. And if you need a ticket to the big concert, they go on sale on September 22nd. It aims Todd Magel, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's news leader.